Hey guys, right now I'm at uh, the Guangzhou South Railway Station. And you may ask, why am I here? Um, I'm actually traveling over to Macau today. So, reasons to travel to Macau, shopping, gambling, um, or if you're here on a certain type of visa, maybe a tourist visa, business visa, a marriage visa, you have to do a visa run. So you have to leave the country every autumn number of days, whatever the requirements of your visa uh, is. So I thought I'd do a video for any of you guys who know, like come here for travel and maybe stay for a while and uh, you end up having to do a visa run. So first thing you gotta do is uh, I suggest you buy your ticket. Uh, what I do is I go on an app called Sea Trip. Very simple, uh, a couple days before or so. And I book my ticket. This is the Sea Trip app. I book my train ticket from Guangzhou and you want to book it to Zhuhai. Now you're asking, why not Macau? Well, because the train doesn't go right into Macau. You gotta go to Zhuhai, and then you gotta walk across the border. A little bit of a fun thing to do during the day. I mean, you can go to Hong Kong, but Hong Kong is gonna cost you a little bit more if you go directly into Hong Kong. Or if you go to Shenzhen, then uh, you still have to take, you know, a metro stop into Hong Kong. Um, you still gotta do some walking, so. I go to Zhuhai, a little bit cheaper and it's faster, it's only about an hour to get to Zhuhai where Hong Kong is about you know, a little under two. So uh, yeah, go from Guangzhou to Zhuhai, then I will show you once I get there the way you need to walk, but you know, nice and early in the morning is what I suggest. Um, if you buy your ticket online, you'll have to come early and go to the same ticket counter as if you, you know didn't buy it but at least you're guaranteed that they'll have the ticket for the time that you want so make your way down Guangzhou Railway South pick up your ticket from one of the four corners of the exit it's the ticketing the windows um, earlier you come like I said the less amount of people are going to be here the less busy it will be and the faster you can get across the border so have a look at how the railway station looks uh, originally you're downstairs and then you go upstairs it's on an elevated platform some trains pulling out now. If the focus gets a little bit better. They're all high speed trains and I'm just at McDonald's having some breakfast elevators. And when I get on the train, I'll show you guys kind of like what the train looks like. And then once we get to Juhai, I'll show you the way to walk and you know, there's also a market over there, and I'm going to do a market video on uh, the cool things they find there. I mean, it's not really as copy market as what we have in Guangzhou, but it's, it's still a nice little shopping market. But anyways, I'm going to eat my uh, my McDonald's. It's like a cheat day for me. I, I haven't eaten McDonald's for a while. I'm trying to get healthy. Uh, I'm going to eat my food, and then I'm going to catch back with you guys once we're in Zhuhai and have that walk that we have to do. So you have to slip your ticketing pass through the gate. And head down to the platform. Could take the stairs, but I was feeling lazy today.
So, I just arrived off the train in Juhai and it's pretty simple. When you get off the train, you're just gonna follow everybody. We're coming out of this exit over here. Once you hit this exit, you wanna go to your right. Down this way, and you'll just keep walking. It's gonna be about a one minute to no more than one minute, maybe a five minute walk. And then you'll end up in this little shopping mall area. I'll, I'll, I'll give you a view of that. And then I'll show you where you have to go to cross the border into Macau. So I'm going to start walking. Let's go. Okay, so we're here already. It's just back there where you have to go. First thing you should do when uh, you get here is go to the very back once you've gotten to the border crossing and pick up a departure arrival card. Uh, this is because you are now exiting mainland China into Macau. Uh, you'll get a visa stamp and all that. I already filled mine out on the train and just so you get a better view. You see right over here to the left right there is where the mall is down the stairs and then over there where the uh, awning is, the overhead, is where you're going to have to walk to. It's a nice big open courtyard, there's a Chinese flag over there, and you just walk over there and start the process. I'd love to be able to show you guys more how you walk to and across the border, but they're very strict as you have to go to the foreigner line. Um, they don't want any filming there for security reasons. It is a border crossing, you have to remember that. So, I'm going to head over, I'm going to cross the border. I hope uh, you enjoyed the video. I hope this was informative to anyone that's in Guangzhou and needs to exit and doesn't want to go to Hong Kong. They'd rather go to Macau to do shopping, gambling, business, any of that. So I'll leave a comment, thumbs up, like, subscribe, any of that shit. And yeah, I'm headed into Macau now. Oh yeah, one other thing, duty free. It's uh, not as big as back home, but it's still pretty fun, it's still pretty good. So this is Collywood checking out with the video from Guangzhou to Zhuhai to Macau. Until next time, take it easy.